In this video, we're about to download and try the brand new Apple Minecraft client. But before we get into this, I want to quickly say I'm giving away two Minecraft accounts and it's very simple. To enter, like this video right now, comment your Discord and you must be subscribed. Winners will be chosen in the next video. For the first time, we're using one of the craziest Minecraft clients for FPS boosting and more. Oh, and it's made by Apple. And if you haven't already, go ahead and join my Discord server because you have a high chance of winning the giveaway. There is one question that has always stumbled across my mind, which is, if Apple were to create a Minecraft client, how would it look? And ladies and gentlemen, today, I believe we finally have the answer. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the official Apple Minecraft client. This is a client that you may have not seen before, despite being ultimately very popular within the community and i believe that the creator of this client has tried creating the closest thing to an apple product in minecraft Aww. that we're ever going to see so as you can see we're on the website right here and i've never downloaded this before i've seen many other creators talking about this client but as you can see from the screenshots this is something i just want to get into right now i am very excited a modern and next generation PvP client for Minecraft just sounds so interesting to me and let's just give this a go. Okay, so we've officially just loaded up the Apple Minecraft client, otherwise known as the Saw client, for the very first time. We're in the launcher right here, and I just wanted to quickly stop and say, if you haven't already, make sure to enter into my giveaway to win Minecraft accounts, and let's continue. So you can see why I call this the Apple client. It's kind of got this Mac kind of theme all about it. Now, I just want to look, okay, it's very straightforward, very basic settings here. Um, we're just going to launch this for the first time. We are literally trying this is the first time my pc could explode right now and shoot off into space and i wouldn't even know so we're about to find out what this client is like okay so we're finally on this client we're signed into minecraft i had to dig deep for my minecraft account details but it looks like we're in the main menu i've turned off the music because i hate the music we're just going to go ahead and sort out all of our settings um you guys know i just like to make sure we've got all of our settings all of our settings looking good So this is the main menu, and you can see why I'm calling this the Apple client. It's very similar to an Apple design. And I'm actually quite interested to see how this plays out in game. Now, it looks like you can change the background, which I think is pretty cool. Um, for me, I like the cute little fox here, so we're just going to roll with that one for now. But I'm going to go straight into multiplayer. Now, we actually have to add hype. Oh, okay, let's just tab this out. Okay, so we've just signed into Hypixel for the first time on the Apple client. Now... I'm quite liking this right off the bat. We're going to press right shift and see. Okay, so this opens up a pretty cool looking menu. Now, as you can see, they actually list all of the brand new mods and changes. They add all the updates I put in the change log right here. But I'm very interested to see how this client looks. Now, I like the little effect it has coming out here. It's very cool, very quirky. Now, it says Apple skin. Now, no joke, this is not affiliated to Apple at all. I have to say that for, for uh, legal purposes. But it says Apple skin. What does that mean? I actually don't understand what that means. Um, I guess it changes how the skin looks. I have no idea. But as you can see, I suppose these are some of the easier mods that you can kind of set up. So you have cosmetics. Wait, do I really have? Okay, that is awesome. I have a flag of Canada. Oh, it's for premium only. Of course it's for premium. Honestly, the 2011 cape on me is actually pretty nice. I wish I had this for real. This cape is probably worth a lot of money, honestly. I have no idea. Anyway, let's run away from all of that because I hate listening to that. Honestly, that is awful. Okay, so I'm, I'm quite interested to see how this client... Okay, so you can add... You can play music through the client. You can add your own profiles. You can take a screenshot. And this is obviously how you move around your mods. So we're going to go ahead and go straight into the player... Um, we're going to go through all of the different mods you can use. So armor status, um, I'm going to use this. So I guess we'll just uh, go back here and enable it. Now, where does that show up? Okay, I suppose we need to wear armor for it to show up. Um, so we're just going to go through the mods that I personally want to use. We'll go clear glass, clear water. We'll show cords, we'll show CPS. We'll show our FPS boost. FPS display, 
FPS spoofer. Okay, so the FPS boost is pretty cool. Um, I guess that creates a bit of a chunk delay. What other mods do they have that we would like? Fulbright. I'll definitely use Fulbright. Godbridge assist. What? Okay, this client could be crazy. Horse stats. Useful mods for high pixel. Okay, pretty cool. Item physics, item info, keystrokes. I want to use that. They've really thought of everything with this client. I've never seen so many mods. We're, we're still going through the mods list. Okay, I think we'll just... Okay, so as you can see... All right, okay, here we go. So now we can actually... Dis I like this a lot. This is a pretty awesome. We're going to put our FPS up here. We'll put our CPS. You know what? Actually, we'll put... We'll put put this in the top left we'll put our coordinates okay so our armor status is right here you know what you know what we're gonna do we're actually gonna put our armor status bottom right our cps bottom left and um that should look good right there our coordinates can go right above there we go okay this is actually pretty nice okay this looks pretty cool i'm actually quite a big fan of this i'm at, i think what i'm gonna do is move the fps um it doesn't look like you can make it any bigger not actually sure how you would do that okay i'll leave our fps at the top so you can monitor but so far we're getting like 500 fps now we are using an fps boost i want to go straight into the game of skywards this is insane what we're doing right now okay we're almost ready for some skywards i just quickly had to enable my toggle sprint as you guys know i love my toggle sprint there we go we'll put that in the top right and um i've also got to just quickly turn off view bobbing and we should be good to go we're always, always sprinting here we go this is our first game okay this is pretty nice i'm not gonna lie i am very excited to try this thing out honestly i know not many of you have probably heard about this client in the premium minecraft scene it is available for free minecraft but we're not using a free minecraft version today however that could be something to try out i just want to see how this client turns out we're getting like 300 500 fps right off the bat okay this is pretty awesome all right, here we go. Let's see how this client performs in the game. Okay, I just want to see. I just I need to see how this thing is. Because honestly, I'm so surprised. This thing is like free. Nobody's even really using it. Like this is pretty awesome. Now when I'm sprinting, it does actually... Uh, the, F the FOV does look a bit strange. Okay. Okay, we instantly got hit off the first game. That is unfortunate. Okay, we're going to act like that game of Sky Wars never actually happened. So this is the first official game on the minecraft apple client now this is what steve jobs would have wanted when he created apple he was thinking about the future of minecraft and that is why this client is pretty awesome man i am very excited and it's definitely a low-key client you know you don't really hear many people talking about this sore client but honestly i'm not sure why because this client looks better than like half of the clients that have been around for years um you know they've done a really good job with the design here I, you can clearly see they they take a lot of care into this client um you know they've definitely taken parts from other clients definitely but this thing is pretty insane man i uh quite a big fan of what we're what we're playing on so far i need to get that chest realistically but we're just gonna chill up here and wait for a bit of mayhem to occur and then strike when needed we're gonna strike with a little mlg water bucket when we need to um don't have potion mod on at the moment which is a bit unfortunate um it would be nice to put that on oh god wait we just killed him oh my god we just got legs oh my god let me let me heal oh my god that was crazy okay we have a power five bow okay um there's some loot down here we should probably go for i think it's safe uh it's not really that safe but it's safe enough we have ender pearls okay we have ender pearls we're actually chilling wait okay oh god okay I'm, I'm botting out right now i don't know what wait okay okay we just avoided that little situation we have some more pearls i'm just gonna leave these guys and just chill here this guy is actually obsessed with me i'm wasting pearls right now though to be honest um which isn't good okay i don't know why i'm botting out so much oh my god we just landed is this a is this aim bot like what is going on we are using aim bot with this bow it's me versus this guy okay okay i'm just gonna I'm just gonna take all the loot gapple up put full diamond on we're actually gonna win our first game our first game by the way how are we not landing that shot wait where am i but okay 
want to take the high ground. Fair enough. He can take the high ground. We still have two ender pearls. I don't think this guy realizes. You want to fight here, buddy? Of course he doesn't. He's terrified. Down there. All the chests have been refilled, brother. Wait, they've all been. Apart from this one. I see him. Oh, we got more pearls. Okay, I'm just gonna jump on this guy, to be honest. Wait, he's on me. Okay. Oh, you're dead. You're dead, buddy. I don't think you remember how I used to run it down in Minecraft. He doesn't know. Wait, he knows. He knows. No, no, no. Oh, we won, we won, GG. That was maybe the noobest fight ever. That was a really poor version of such speed you just witnessed. Oh my god. Okay, I thought we couldn't try out the Apple Minecraft client without playing a quick game of Bed Wars. Now, it is many hours later, and I've been playing quite a lot of Minecraft, although I didn't really feel like recording. It's currently 3 a.m. now, and uh, for some reason, I'm in the mood to just record a game of Bed Wars. So, to be honest, this client really reminds me of the Badline client with how it feels. Um, I'm not sure if there's any kind of relation to the Badline client. There's probably not, but in terms of how this client feels when I'm PvPing and like how smooth it feels on Hypixel, definitely feels a lot towards like Badline, which is a good thing. And I could see myself using this client quite a lot in the future. I've seen a lot of other creators try out this client, and honestly, I'm quite a big fan of it. Um, I do think it's pretty good, especially considering I believe it was made by just like one person. So one developer created this whole client, and you know, I'm not sure whether some parts have been taken from other clients or what but it definitely feels very cool um i feel like when i was recording the rest of this video earlier today and yesterday um you're getting a very different side of such speed right now like i am very tired um and i, I don't know so i used to record a lot when i was tired and sometimes i get my best gameplay and my best commentary and like talking just into the microphone when i'm absolutely sleep deprived so i'm just kind of giving that a go and obviously that's not good for me now the one thing i do like about this client is actually the um the whole the the, the theme you have like that's the one thing that reminds me of apple if anything um, this guy is an absolute wow is this the kind of players you get at 3 a.m wow that like i don't even know what i just witnessed um i'm gonna go for their bed just because hold on wait how is that just like okay it doesn't even matter but like what oh my god is anyone going for me no they're not okay this guy's gonna spawn back in like how is this guy now okay what and now he's just like running away hello oh my god a sheer out of nowhere that's crazy I actually respect that. If that worked, I would have ended the video right there and turned my computer off. Like, on the spot, PC off. That could not fly. Um, so, I did some more research into the Saw client. And like I said, it looks like it's just one developer. Which, again, is pretty insane if they've created this whole client on their own. Um, I've got to hand it to them, honestly. Um, you know, people are talented. And I definitely don't have the skill or the time to create my own client. So, I've got to hand it to this guy. Well, well, very well done. Um, we take yellow here. Hopefully they're not watching. I didn't see them at all, so I haven't died. I've actually just trolled. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Change of plans, boys. Change of plans. I didn't know that was occurring right there. That diamond armor. Nice. Hello. Does he not want his bed? I guess he doesn't really care for it. I feel like this guy's gonna turn around on me. Bed doesn't want his bed, I guess. Who knows? What a strat from this guy, honestly. Oh, nice. I can't even hit. Okay, cool. Get. <sighs> I hope you enjoyed this video. It had to end this way. Goodbye.